hi guys welcome back to my channel how are you guys doing today hope you guys are doing well so today's video i will be making a diy moisture oil moisturizing lotion so guys i hear here is a basil leaf so i'm going to add a little bit of this to inside here i have my rosemary leaf which i'm also going to add a little inside as you can see so guys here is my chives leaf so i'm also going to add a little of the chives which is really good for our hair group guys all these are really good for our hair grow all these herbs they are really good so i'm going to add a really much to that so here i so that is past leaf so here i have my oregano leaf which is also good for hair growth so i'm going to add a little much <laughs> of oregano leaf so then i'm just going to add so here is sage sage is also known for hair growth as well so i'm going to add sage as well so here i have my glove glove is also a very powerful hair growth product that can really help well for our hair growth so i'm going to add that as well then now uh, all my blend ingredients is ready like my leaf and seed is ready i'm going to just blend this now so I'm going to blend everything into a powder form. So to my returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming. If you are new here, you are also welcome. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. So if you are if you like this video, please do subscribe and turn on your post notification so that you will not miss out any of my new video. So guys, after blending, this is how it's looking like now it's now a ponder form so i'm going to just transfer this inside my jug because i will be infusing this for a month so this actually take more than a month so i just abandoned it since i was doing other things so i just leave it there just give it some time to infuse so i'm just going to transfer it inside this inside the um, jug then I will add my oil that I'm going to use to infuse it. So this oils you can use it on its own without making like um moisturizing lotion or anything. So here I have my this is my neem powder. So I'm going to add two spoon of my neem powder. So Neem is also good for our hair guys they also have a lot of benefits to our hair here i have my amla powder as well i'm going to add two spoon of this amla powder so amla is is also good for our hair growth as well it's very beneficial for our hair so i'm going to add two spoon of this amla powder to my powder here i have transfula transfula is three kinds um, powerful ingredients aba ingredient ayurvedic ingredients that can really contribute to hair growth so i'm going to add two spoon of transfula as well so which is really good to promote your hair growth and the uh, solve all your hair and scalp issue so now i've already added all my powder to it so i'm just going to mix then i will then con continue by adding my oils so this is really a great product that can really contribute to your hair growth and can also cure all your health problem so my base my first base oil is uh olive oil so the second base oil is my grape seed oil so the rest i will be adding two spoon of each other oil that i will be using 
today so first of all i'm going to miss it miss uh, the powder and the oil together before i will start adding the rest of my oils so here i have my salt flower oil which is capable to stimulate the blood in your scalp and uh, as well contribute to hair growth here i have my weight gem oil which can also help to promote your hair growth here is um i have my my sweet almond oil so which can also contribute to your hair growth as well so i'm just going to miss that now then i will just cover it then i will just cover it then i will just allow it to infuse on its own i'm also going to put it in hot water every day or every other day for this one month plus so i was thinking of what to do with it before <laughs> then i finally decided on using it to make a moisturizing hair lotion so here i have my okra so okra is a very good product that can really moisturize your hair and as well contribute to hair growth so i'm going to cut my okra into this little pieces So now I'm going to put the okra inside this pot. Then I will add my flaxseed gel. Flaxseed gel is also good to contribute to hair growth and as well moisturize your hair. So I'm going to add one cup of water as well. So, so now I'm going to break this to cook. Then I will move to the next step. So the next step is aloe vera so here is my aloe vera so aloe vera is a very great product for hair growth and also good to moisturize your hair as well so here is a very uh, i'm going to just cut it and take away the skin because i will be needing the the gel So after cutting it, I'm going to put it in my blender and go and blend it. So here is my okra and flash seed gel already. So I'm going to just use my sauce card to press out the gel. Then I'll just press out the gel out of the seed. So guys, this is how my okra and the flaxseed gel is looking like. This is super moisturizing to our hair that can really contribute to hair growth. So now here is my um, aloe vera gel. So I'm going to also press this out now with my sauce cap. So now here I have my aloe vera, okra and flaxseed gel. So now I'm going to add a one spoon of grizzly to this uh, gel, which is this is going to be the water phase of our product today. So now I'm going to just set this outside, then we will move on to the oil phase. This product is really good, guys. Just relax and you will just uh, follow the recipe. But the video is a bit long here with me okay so here i have my oil this is about a month plus now so i'm going to use my sauce cap as well to strain out the oil
so guys after uh, straining out the oil so now i'm going to add my palm oil so that is the oil that i, I infuse so now i'm going to add other oil that i cannot use to infuse it so i'm going to be adding my palm oil i'm going to add my coconut oil so you can use any oil that you know you like that your hair love whenever you use it on your hair you can also add that to it if there's any oil that i use that your hair did not like you can also remove it okay so now i'm going to be adding my my castor oil so people like love castor oil because it's good to strengthen and also grow our hair so the next thing i'm adding my um shea butter which is good to moisturize our hair as well so when you are making a moisturizing hair grow lotion you need to use things that you know are really good to moisturize your hair and things that are really good to grow your hair so here yeah, i'm going to add that uh, to it so the next thing i will be adding my um, cocoa cocoa butter so i'll be adding that cocoa butter to it as well so the next thing is my emulsifying wax yeah i have only emulsifying wax if you have any other thickener that you know you use for your product you can as well add that to this oil phase so now i'm going to bring everything to melt both the uh, water phase i'm going to put them in uh, hot water for them to have the same temperature so then here we are i just take them out of the water i don't want to film that part because i don't this video is already long enough <laughs> so i'm going to add everything the gel inside the oil so then i will just mix them together so i first of all used this my small spatula to mix this together now So now as you can see how it is now, I'm going to use my hand blender to mix this as well. So it can turn to a very uh, fluffy and creamy and then looking so smooth. So this is how I'm going to be doing this with my hand blender to mix the oil together very well so that the oil will not separate later on so take your time to really miss this very well miss it very well so everything can really combine together So guys after missing it for a couple of time this is how it's looking like now so this is how fluffy and nice it's looking like but i'm i'm still going to be missing it again so i'm just going to show you how this product is going to absorb into your hair as you can see how it absorbs into my skin without any stress at all and it leaves that moisturizing shiny look this is how your hair is going to be as you can see how shiny and moisturizing and it absorbs into my skin very well this is how it's going to absorb into your hair very well when you use it on your hair so now 
I will just go off camera and miss. So after missing it off camera, I allow it to cool down for a couple of time. So here I am now. I'm going to just add my my preservative and essential oil and uh, my vitamin E oil. So that is the last thing we will be adding to this. Here is my preservative. So don't add too much of preservative because too much of preservative is not also good as well. Just be mindful how, uh, how you add preservative to your product. So that now I'm going to add my vitamin E oil. So vitamin E is also good for our hair as well and uh, it's also good to add to your product. So here I'm going to add my treat, uh, essential oil. So I have three tea, cinnamon and the rest of the essential oil I will be adding. Thing. So guys, I'm done adding everything to it. I'm just going to give it one last time. Miss, 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 miss. <laughs> you got. I'm going to give it one last time. Miss. Then I will just. It's done. We are we are done with making our moisturizing hair growth lotion. As you can see how it's looking like now. So this is how I made my moisturizing hair grow lotion guy let me say this before i can make this i've tried several times without <laughs> getting any progress so now i am i think i've tried now I, as you guys can see this is how it's looking like now so i'm so happy i can really put everything together and make this beautiful hair grow oil moisturizing lotion for you guys so this is how my product is looking like now very creamy and fluffy and it's so moisturizing guys trust me it's very very moisturizing so i went off camera and then i put it inside this jar <laughs> this is the jug and the other one is a bottle and um, a plastic uh, container so then I have some in there that is about 450 ml of plastic container so here is the product guys as you can see so moisturizing so creamy and so fluffy so guys this is going to be the end of today's video if you like subscribe turn on your post notification so that you will not miss out any of my new video then i will see you all in my next one share this video with your friends and family bye bye thank you so much for watching i really do appreciate you guys i will see you in my next one stay safe bye bye